Good afternoon, ladies. We're going to start with Charles Dickens. We're going to go first to look at the words in the yellow box. Author, it means muallif. Clerk, it means katib. ومش أظهم هون كاتب كاتب روايات أظهم الكاتب اللي بكون بيشتغل بالمكاتب يعني موظف مثل السكرتير تقريبا أوكي جورناليست صحفي لاير محامي ناريتر راوي نوفلست روائي the person who writes novels أوكي بلاي رايت كاتب مسرحي and poet شاعر تشارلز ديكنز as we said, we have seven paragraphs, as you see, uh, like in the mind map, the first paragraph. Charles Dickens was born on 7th February, 1812, where this is the time and this is the place where he was born, in a place in a city called Portsmouth on the southern coast, okay, Shata el Janubi. Uh, of England. Paragraph number two. Here are the main characteristics. الصفات الشخصية لس Charles Dickens. He was a quiet boy, Hadi, who loved reading. When he spoke later of his childhood, لما كان يحكي عن طفولته, childhood, he said that he remembered listening to children playing outside. He remembered, can it occur, that he was listening to children, they were playing outside. While, بينما هو كان إيش بعمل? He sat, okay, indoors, كان قاعد جوا بالبيت بالداخل, indoors, يعني inside the house. He always preferred, preferred, يفضل, كان دائما بفضل, reading to playing, بفضل إنه يقرأ على إنه يلعب outside with other children. Paragraph number three, at the age of 12, now at the age of 12, it was, uh, it has, uh, sorry, it had lots of problems for Charles, life for his family changed, changed طبعا badly, تغيرت للأسوأ, very suddenly, his father had financial problems, what happened to the family, what happened to his family, شو صار للعيلة, his father had financial, maddian, problems. So, as a result of the financial problems, Charles was no longer able to attend the school. نتيجة للمشاكل المادية, Charles was no longer able to attend the schools regularly. ما كان بقدر يروح على المدرسة يداوم بشكل منتظم. And he had to work at a factory. اضطر إنه يشتغل بي فاكتوري The loneliness طبعا he felt lonely okay where at the factory while he was working the loneliness he felt there there refers to factory was an important influence the loneliness he felt الوحدة والحزن اللي شعر فيهم okay influence influence it means أثرت okay الوحدة اللي كان يشعر فيها أثرت on his writing one of the books that he wrote lately طبعا بعدين كتب بعض الكتب وكان الواضح فيها شعوره بالحزن والوحدة one of his, in his books Great Expectation so this is the first novel Great Expectation and another one David Copperfield so what did he highlighted what's the meaning of highlight يعني uh, ألقى الضوء على إيش ألقى الضوء بال Great Expectation وديفيد كوبرفيلد ألقى الضوء على loneliness okay or the mood of great expectation and David Copperfield was lonely paragraph number four when he was 14 at the age of 14 Charles stopped going to school altogether بطل يروح على المدرسة أبدا and he started working as a clerk clerk قلنا كاتب مثل السكرتير in where, where did he work at the age of 14? Where did he work? He worked as a clerk in a lawyer's office in London. Did he like the job? He didn't like working there. طبعاً there refers to lawyer's office in London. Now, paragraph number five, lucky. Okay, we're going to, to talk about luck. How lucky he became. 
luckily لحسن الحظ things changed for him طبعا تشارلز again how كيف صار الوضع تحسن عنده تشارلز had always wanted to be a writer he always dreamed to be a writer and he became a very respected journalist he had a dream to be a writer so his life it changed and he became أصبح respected journalist صحفي محترم بما إنه صار صحفي he began to write short pieces of for publication short pieces for publication اللي هي مقتطفات قصيرة للنشر يعني صار يكتب مقتطفات قصيرة أو مقالات قصيرة عشان ينشرها publication نشر um, publication in the newspaper كانت تنزل طبعا بالجرائد newspaper بالجريدة in 1836 a series of pieces called صار في إشي عنده مقالات ثابتة كل شهر بتنزل okay series يعني زي المتسلسلة okay of pieces called the pickwick papers إذا هاي ال pickwick papers هي مقالات ثابتة كانت تنزل بشكل مستمر بالصحيفة أو بالجريدة appeared monthly ظهرت بكل شهر كل شهر كان ينزل مقالة in the newspaper and were very popular مين هم ال where were very popular اللي هي ال ال pickwick papers هاي ال pickwick papers المقالات القصيرة كانت كتير popular popular it means famous مشهورة شائعة Dickens was famous author by then so Dickens be was became very famous author كاتب مشهور then refers to the date thirty eighteen thirty six paragraph number six throughout his life من خلال حياته ومسيرته المهنية يعني Dickens enjoyed he liked the traveling he was traveling from country to another he traveled to many countries كان يسافر لعدة دول what was he doing he was writing novels and giving talks giving talks يعني كان يعني يعطي speech يعطي محاضرات أو يتحدث يتحدث عن إيش ويكتب نوفلز عن إيش about the cruelty of slavery cruelty of slavery it means القسوة التي يتعرض لها العبير cruelty قسوة و slavery اللي هم العبيد novels such as Oliver Twist إذن عنا هون Oliver Twist من رواياته and Dombey and Son another novel رواية ورواية أسماء روايات What were they talking about? What did they highlighted? Highlighted يعني ألقوا الضوء على Highlight it means ألقى الضوء على Highlighted the cruel treatment of people إذن Oliver Twist and Dombey and Son Highlighted ألقى الضوء على The cruel treatment Cruel قسوة قسوة treatment يعني معاملة قسوة المعاملة للناس بالذات specially children الأطفال and برضو ألقت الضوء على هاي الروايات child labor إذا عندنا highlighted two main things cruel treatment of people number two child labor اللي هي عمالة الأطفال إذا رواياته تحدثت وألقت الضوء على المعاملة القاسية for people and children number two child labor اللي هي معام عمالة الأطفال تشغيل الأطفال يعني in the 19th century especially in the 19th century he was living the last paragraph death he died on 8th of June 1870 how old he was when he died he was 58 the same as number of the page okay ladies have a nice day uh, focus on the main ideas focus on the mind map write the words in the um, uh, yellow box with the meaning of the words in uh, in arabic in your book or in your notebook then we're going to discuss the questions inshallah later on have a nice day